everyone, I'm Zara Borja and this is Cyber Singles. Today we're going to ask the question if the internet is replacing social interaction. Hmm, intriguing question in this day and age. Let's take a look. A lot of time, yes, yes. I think it's a very addictive place. Again, people feel safer and they don't go out as much. And sometimes they stay beyond the wall and get isolated in their own homes thinking they have this other life that is not really real. I know people that, you know, are married and having this all secret life on the internet. So I think there's a fine line and I think you have to be careful with that and not lose yourself in the process and get out there and meet people and have social interactions and, and dinners with friends and parties. It's important. It's important for anyone. I don't think you can ever really replace uh you know, social venues as a means of meeting people. That's always going to happen. Um, I would hate to think of, you know, millions of people shut up in their homes, uh, eyes glazed, uh, fingers tapping on the computer, hoping to make a connection with another human being out there. I mean, you know, you, you've got bowling alleys, you've got uh, parks, you've got uh, concerts. There's so many great ways of meeting women that, uh, you know, sitting alone in your room at a computer is a kind of dismal way to go about it. Yeah. I think the internet has become that thing that draws people together. And uh, I, I, think it, I think it's fine, you know. People tend to get caught up in their own narrow existences otherwise. Maybe this is a good thing. In, in society, sadly, it is. And that's kind of a bone of contention I have. Uh, it's much easier to blast an email to a dozen people than to phone them and talk to them individually and give them the information, obviously. So again, you can save a lot of time. Uh, but I think people use that or actually abuse it because, again, from my generational perspective, there are certain invitations, certain things that should entail a phone call or even a written you know, message. It shows a level of caring that the internet doesn't. Think about this. In fact, it doesn't replace social interaction, it is social interaction. You can't possibly have an internet relationship or meet somebody without having some base social skills. I mean, there's no qualms in shutting somebody down. So if their first question is, how old were you when you lost your virginity, boom, that guy's gone, right? On the other hand, if he says, hey, what are your goals? What are you looking for? Now that draws them out, right? And they want to start talking about those things. It's pure social interaction. No, it does not replace it. Oh, checking Facebook, Twitter. Oh, hi. <laughs> Until next time, this was Cyber Singles.